Hello again everyone, welcome back to my channel. If you've not been here before, my name is Isabel Celine. Please do hit that subscribe button and the like button as well if you would like to see more from me. Today's video is a Primark haul. By the way, little comment on my outfit, I'm not sure if I like it or not. Just threw it on, not sure if it's okay, but this is from Femlox and this is from Organic Basic. So I'm not sure if I like it, I'm just testing this out for this video to see when I edit it, if I like it or not. Please don't hate me on this look because I'm just trying to test out whether I like it or not, but let me know what your thoughts are. Let's get into this video. This is a Primark haul that I've got ready for Portugal. So without further ado, let's go. <laughs> suitcase because I didn't want to get one of them bags that rip all the time so I'm gonna show you my suitcase so I got oh my god it's so heavy with all the stuff in it I've got this black case for 30 pound basic I'm not gonna show you too much because it's gonna be too much because it's so heavy so everything is inside the suitcase so I need to open this up and get it all out for you so back in a sec quick story about my suitcase while I've had to buy another one is the one that I had before when I came back from Ibiza it came back with a massive gash in it so I was like great Ain't using that no more. So again, my mum should just gaffer tapes it. So I've got a new one. Quite like that it's black because they didn't have much in Primark for suitcases. Especially the size that I wanted because these ones were like way too big. So that was a perfect size for me. I also go for £30. So here is what I got. I got this cute little kind of like neon sage green sort of colour. It's kind of like a crop top. I'd say it's more of a t-shirt than a crop top. It's got like these little frilly bits on the hems and on the arms. This was only £5 and I got in a two extra small. It says extra here. I thought they looked really cute with like some white jeans or some shorts, especially in Portugal. So I quite like this. As Mother's Day is coming up, probably being gone by the time this video is up, I bought these for my mum. Some slippers for £3 because I was going to get her some like cute little things. And she keeps wearing my slippers, so I was like, mum needs her own slippers. So I got her some. I was checking out the right size and yeah, I do. Good for £3. I love these. They're all super comfortable and they're just easy to slip on. Also picked her up some socks. These were £2.50. She likes like mad prints, so I got loads of printed socks so she keeps nicking mine and my stepdad socks as well and putting holes in them so i got her own socks as well still on the subject of mother's day i picked up this frame for i think it was three pound fifty and i got a cute little photo to put in it so it looked nice in the room because the room's got like, got like gold accents in there so i thought that looked quite sweet and it's a nice little present to get because i love photos and memories i'm always like taking photos in situations where i'm just like yeah that's a nice memory and i thought i'll put it in a frame for her Login of the day so i was walking around primark on saturday and they had like a little reduction section because i literally go straight for that red area because it has them red, red signs as you know if you're going to primark and they had some jeans for a pound a pound what i also saw someone putting like a shitload in the basket and i'm like what are you doing what about other people can we just talk about the bulk buying of what people are doing with the coronavirus why are people buying so many tissues it doesn't come with the shits anyway back onto the jeans just have to mention that i've got skinny mid-rise jeans in a size six i haven't yet tried these on i've got a leg 30 inch leg they look like yeah they look like they'd fit well i hope they will either way they're a pound so i'm not even going to complain so yeah i always wanted some really dark jeans and these are quite lightweight so these are good for like summer as well forgot i bought this i bought my mum a little buddha for mother's day because she seems to love buddhas and i've got that for three pound fifty it's so lightweight as well she just seems to love these random little things story of this next item is adam has a flintstone top he wears the bed that says bone idol and it has like this character on there so i bought one to match and this was only three pounds that's the reason why i bought it because it's three pounds and i used to love the flintstones when i was a kid i've got a size two extra small and it's still like quite big so it can be worn as like a, a night t-shirt or whatever or even with like cycling shorts and trainers in the summer three pound can't really uh ask for much more can ya has the little logo on the side there the whole family oh she's so cute oh, i bring up memory this was like my favorite character down here i loved her then right at the bottom of my basket i completely forgot about when i got to the till is this bodysuit for five pound and it's quite high neck which i quite like so i don't have many high neck t-shirts or anything or bodysuits and it looks like it's gonna be quite comfortable i love the material it's like quite silky and i got it for five pound in a two extra small thing that looked quite nice with jeans shorts anything in general i just love the feel of it feel of something always draws me and makes me want to just chuck it in the basket so in the makeup section i bought this iridescent priming elixir and it says two pound and it was four pound got to the till 50p quite happy with that little purchase i thought i'll mix that with my primer to see if it makes it um or is it an actual primer then we of vitamin three in chamomile i'll probably mix it with my primer see what it does cruelty free as well so i'm quite happy with that and it seems to be easy enough to just squeeze out and put it out. You, you know what i mean 
I'm not very good at explaining things. My favourite thing that I bought is this bag. It's so much like a Bottega Viennetta bag. Also, let me show you what one I bought. This isn't from Primark, but I got this from Fashion Drug. And oh my god, I love it. It's literally the best dupe of the Bottega Viennetta bag. And it's so big and it has a nice strap. I actually put the strap on myself because it comes separately. I just love it and it's vegan leather. I just wanted to shout that out. Anyway, if you want to buy one, link it down below for you. I got this for 60 something pound because they do it in euros. So I'm not quite sure how much it would be because obviously euro rate changes all the time. So I'm very happy with that. But because that one's so big, I wanted a smaller one. So I got this one for £8 in Primark. And it's kind of like backwards to the Vionetta, Bottega Vionetta bag. So it's got like all the stitching here where it like ruches it in. And then the open bit here. A bit of poofing off. A bit of poofiness in there. And it comes with a chain. So it's like slightly different to the Bottegas themselves so that's like a slight different design and i think this one's more practical than the other one especially for daytime and whatever so i thought that one would be so much nicer it'll go with a lot more it's only eight pounds so you can't really moan there very happy with it it'll go i keep thinking i'll wear it with like more in the autumn and winter as well this bag and that other one more in like summer spring time so it goes with more of a wardrobe i went into the men's section because adam wanted a few things and i walked around the whole shop downstairs where all the women's stuff was i couldn't find a decent hoodie go to the men's section perfect hoodies go in for only eight pounds so i bought a, a extra small in the men's size it's so cozy and definitely wearing this to the airport to portugal I get an extra small yeah i've got an extra small and it's still got that bagginess to it and i love the pocket on the front that's what i love i love to just Put my hands in the pocket and just chill so i got it in a white and i also got it in a black because you can't have you know one without the other i would have loved to have got a nude but they didn't have a nude they had like a bright pink and a bright yellow and i was like nah so i'll stick with this so it's, it's just so cozy but i put it on there was so much fluff that went on a white t-shirt i was so annoyed but yeah it's like quite big even though it's an extra small i'm quite happy with that so i'll definitely shop in the men's section more often for hoodies but now that i've got them I'm quite happy. I've got a present for my brother, but I can't show you. But it's uh... James. If you're watching, please don't watch now, okay? <laughs> so I got him. You best not be watching this, James. I got him Dragon Ball Z socks because he fucking loves Dragon Ball Z. So I seen him. I was like, I bought him everything already, and I was like, and he's getting these because he loves it so much. So they look so cool as well, like how bright they are. So I just couldn't not. And they're six pounds. So I hope you weren't watching that, James. I wasn't going to be annoyed at you. I just love them. I even had wear these. They're so funky. So that is it for my Primark haul. I've just filmed a Ego shoes haul as well, which will either be up after or before this. I will link the Ego shoes haul down below for you or in the eye if it's already up for you. And other than that, I do hope you subscribe and come back again soon. Please do like and comment down below what you liked in this haul and whatever things you would like to see on my channel. And I will see you again soon. Bye, guys.